Hey everybody, this is Royce here with Gage 3 Designs, and I'm back with another episode. Um, today we're back in the home that I um, previously worked on in the latest episode. Um, now we're in the kitchen area. Um, before we did the living room and the whole loft area, you can see here. So now I want to um, doctor up the kitchen area to see what type of look I want to have. Um, I have some ideas, so I'll go ahead and take a stab at those ideas. Um, and if I don't like it, just change some things along the way. So let's get started. So for starters, we're going to use the same wood, um, same wood floor. So let's go ahead and find that wood. Here we go. It's the light wood here. Whoops. Make sure we double click to get inside the component. All right. Let's go ahead and add some lighting. Well, first, let's see what light we get in here. Um, it's not going to be very much, but uh, let's just see what we got here again here's the previous you know area looking toward the loft and I think this looks really nice and we're gonna kind of keep it consistent and not do something totally different but we do want the kitchen to be its own but at the same time it all has to come together all right so we got a little bit of light coming in on this side so let's go ahead and add some lighting I think first I want to add some light fixtures all right, so I found these ceiling lights I thought looked pretty cool and will go pretty well within this home. Um, so let's go ahead and add an emitter to these bulbs. Emitters, fluorescent 65 watt, we're on the blue axis, okay. Oh, we're all the way over there. Let's kind of bring it over a little bit. And if I use, if I use number 11, it should spread pretty well. So let's go ahead and uh, let's choose 11 and I think 32 would be fine, but just try 35. And scene one, whoops, thought it crashed on me. Side here, like so. Yeah, lights it up nice. Um, now this. The reason I like this is because we have the light up here. It gives me the opportunity to add some light on the backsplash. All right, so we got some light here on the island. Let's add some more light to where the backsplash is going to be. And I think I'm going to do some lighting above here, going up the wall. Um, selecting a light. We'll just do some drop downs here. And this won't be too much. We'll do like a, let's see, a one might be fine, actually. But I kind of want it to spread out. So let's do 19. And let's put it at 10. Let's see what that gives us. Let's go ahead and back out. Okay, that'll work, and we'll just spread that along the um, backsplash. I went ahead and spread the light along the backsplash. Let's see how this looks here. Okay, nice. I like that. So let's add a tile here. We had the white marble tile. All right. And let's throw some stainless steel. And let's do the same type of tile. We'll just sample paint here. We need some stainless steel here on these appliances. 
sample paint there. But for this crown molding, I definitely want to do like a wood texture. So um, let's do this here. Just pick a color. Whoops. Pick a color. And then we'll just go to edit and match color of object and model. So we'll just match this color there. That looks like I missed one here. All right. Let's go ahead and get the rest of it. There we go. All right. Yeah, we got our uh, pretty nice. All right. And let's add some stainless steel to the refrigerator. We'll just sample paint. All right, let's go ahead and start throwing some lights up above here. Oh, it looks like I missed a spot. All right. All right, let's hit this backsplash. So let's see what we got. Um, let's go to online repository for this one. So we have our ceramics. I kind of want it to jive with, whoops. Want it to jive with uh, the wood that's going on. I really like this stack stone right here. And what we can do is we can we can change the color of it. Yeah, let's try this one out. I forgot about this. I really like that as a backsplash. Let's see how a trim would look. Okay, there we go. I like the trim. I think it was this one I used for the couch. We'll use that one also for the chairs. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and add some accessories. Like I got here, I got some lemons with some um, cups and everything. I'm going to go ahead and add some stuff to the countertops and jazz up this sink here and we'll be done. So, um, Hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe if you're not subscribed. Thanks.